I'm Kim Gaddis. And I'm Mark Gaddis. Mark was uh, pretty recently diagnosed with stage four lung cancer. When, when you find out you have cancer, everybody thinks the first thing you're going to do is chemo. Dr. Langer assured me, he said, chemo is the last thing we want you to do right now. He goes, there's a lot of other options out there. Because of Mark's medical history and he was healthy, um, they decided to test his tumor for a genetic mutation. We had never heard about it and um, they explained that there's a certain way your cells in, within your cancer mutate. Certain numbers of people will have this, but it's a pretty low percentage. So they uh, told us we'd have to wait a couple weeks and they had to take the part of his tumor uh, and send it out for some testing. We had everyone with us, you know, just praying for that answer, for it to be the mutation, because that mm -hmm. would just change the course of treatment from going from regular chemo and radiation to possibly, as Dr. Langer put it, just a pill form yeah. of treatment. I was driving home on the Schuylkill Expressway and I got the phone call from the nurse and she said, oh, we're so happy for you. You got tested positive for one of the mutations. We haven't seen this mutation for a while and I'm driving in traffic and I'm, <laughs> I'm screaming. Everybody probably around me on the Schuylkill is probably wondering, what the heck is this guy doing? You know, up until then it was, Mark was, his health was declining. Mm -hmm. He wasn't able to do the things he normally could do. Yeah. The cough was relentless. And uh, just to get that news that they found, you know, one of the rarest mutations, right. that just gave us that. hope. Yeah. Gave us hope for treatment. And um, doctors told us that, you know, there were several medications, but one of them was a new drug, a clinical drug. And we decided to, yeah. to go that route. Within it's, a few days of starting his medication, mm -hmm. he just totally mm -hmm. turned around health-wise. So far, we've just had phenomenal, mm -hmm. phenomenal results. And yes. we just recently had your eight-week checkup. Mm -hmm. And Yeah, it was awesome. 80% uh, of my tumor has shrunk in my lung. My lung. My lymph nodes are almost back to normal. I don't have no meds on my brain. And before, when I was diagnosed also, I had some uh, lesions on my spinal cord also, and they're almost coming back to healing also. So we expected some result, but I never expected this much result. It's brought hope to our, yeah. to a situation mm -hmm. that might, you know, otherwise seem hopeless. Mm -hmm. Before I, I was saying I had to stop when I walked, the other day I rode my bike for eight miles and it was a lot of hills. No problems, I'm not having any problem breathing. I can't wait for my next eight week scan. It's gonna be, yeah. it's gonna be awesome, I know it is. It's just amazing how everything's just healing. We're happy just to sit here and, and encourage you. Yes. You know, if you're facing the, the same situation, we just mm. implore you to seek treatment at the Abramson Cancer Center. Yes. We can't thank them enough. We're definitely on the right path.